What's good, my beautiful DC brothers and sisters? It's your boy, the Truth 31. Hit like, subscribe for all that DC goodness on your face, neck, and chest. And so, my boy, Jason Kilar, dropping some hints, dropping some breadcrumbs, you know, teasing us, teasing us Batfleck fans, teasing us DC fans. So if you don't know, Jason uh, Kilar, who is the uh, CEO of Warner Media, just dropped this on his Twitter and it's and of course all the Snyder Cut fans, all the DC fans, including myself, are just like fucking nutting on our on ourselves, just fucking having an orgasm because you know we're just speculating like, oh shit, is is he dropping some fucking hints for the future? Is he dropping those hints for Batfleck for, for that fucking Batfleck TV show on HBO Max? I fucking hope so because this image that that he posted today on Twitter earlier today. Look at that fucking bat symbol, bro. That's that fucking bat flex symbol. That's that fucking fat, juicy bat, that fat Batman that we all love. That's the fucking bat flex symbol. And the background is very much Gotham City, the Gotham City from BVS. The same Gotham City that we saw right here on the, uh, I think it was the BVS uh, Super Bowl spot where you see fucking Affleck just fucking looking over Gotham City in that fucking beautiful image. And I don't know if that shot was part of the of um, BVS or that was just like a, a a special shot for the Super Bowl the Super Bowl promo. But that shot was fucking beautiful. Just like look, any, anything fucking Zack Snyder shoots is gonna look fucking. It, it's a it's Viagra for the eye. So again, I don't know if this is a hint. I know a lot of us, including myself, are just like fucking like yes, yes, yes. This this is it. This is confirmation that the fucking Batflex show is going to happen. But of course, you know, nothing official has been announced. Not, 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 you know, no news on it yet. But I think we all know that it's, it's bound to happen. Because obviously with the, with the whole Snyder cut and the, you know, Batflex coming back for additional photography, it's only a matter of time before they announce something. Of course, we're all, there. I think HBO Max is going to wait to see how the Snyder Cup performs on HBO Max. But I'm telling you, that shit is going to fucking shut down. That shit's going to fucking crash. When the Snyder Cup premieres on HBO Max, everyone is going to go fucking bananas. And of course, you know, with the additional photography for Jared Leto Joker and Deathstroke, this is just, again, pushing that, pushing this idea forward. The, the concept for the for the for the um Batflex show that Jared Leto and Joe Magna -na 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 -na, <laughs> as Deathstroke and, is gonna come back for a Batflex TV show, possibly a miniseries, uh, but a fucking and people think like oh uh, like why not for like a, a theatrical release? But again, we don't know if this, if you know if movie if movie theaters are gonna be open by like twenty twenty one or twenty twenty two, and plus you know if putting on streaming. This isn't some fucking CW shit. HBO Max streaming is gonna is gonna massive production. They're gonna put millions and millions behind this show, if it happens, when it happens, I should say. So it's not gonna be some you know low budget rinky dink CW Superman Lois bullshit. No no no. This is gonna be like fucking. If you haven't seen Game of Thrones, watch Game of Thrones. Look at that fucking production value. Like it's it's like a fucking full on epic uh, fucking movie. That you would see in fucking like in Lord of the Rings or something. And the fact that this is going to have like the same quality to it for the Batfleck miniseries. Bro, I'm not even worried about it, bro. I'm not worried about it. It's going to be amazing. It's going to be amazing. We're all going to flip out. We're all going to fucking cry in tears. We're all going to have our fucking uh, nerdgasm watching Batfleck and Deathstroke go at it fucking Arkham Origin style. And I cannot fucking wait for this shit. Of course, and you throw in fucking Jared Leto in the mix too. Oh, my dude, how can you not be excited, bro? How can you not be excited? I'm fucking hyped. If you're not hyped for this, I don't know what's wrong with you. You're probably hyped for fucking uh, Captain Marvel 2 or, 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 or fucking A-Force or, or some dumb bullshit like that. <laughs> but for the rest of us, for, for, for the fucking normal fans out there, for the hardcore fucking comic book fans, DC fans, we're all, we're all fucking creaming in our pants waiting for this shit. And of course, you know, with these... With uh, Zack Snyder just announcing this, with those, where he's like shooting something cool with Superman, Lois, and Batfleck, I mean, again, this is all just a setup for the future, and that future is gonna include that Batfleck TV show. So I'm fucking excited. But anyway, those are my thoughts. Smash that fucking like button, my beautiful DC brothers and sisters. Subscribe. Hit me up on Twitter, Instagram. Let's continue having a decent conversation as always. Support DC. Love DC. Do you think Jason Kilar is dropping hints for the future? of a Batfleck TV show on HBO Max? Or do you think I'm fucking crazy? Or do you think I'm fucking right?
as always, truth out.